Princess Cat here. Welcome back to my channel. To be honest, it's really welcomed myself back to my own channel because I've been gone for seven months. <laughs> so for those of you who have been subscribed to me for those seven months still, <coughs> thank you. I'm I'm sorry that I haven't been on and honestly the excuse as to why I was gone isn't even better. I've just been in school. I've been lazy. I've been lazy and I didn't even come back with a glow up or anything. I look the same. I don't, I don't, I don't know. I have, I have nothing else to say other than that. But um, a lot has happened in the time, in the time that I've been gone. I can fill you in in the future videos on what's going on, what's going on in my life. And, and actually in a three, in three months or so, I'm graduating high school and going off into the real world so that ought to be interesting. It took me forever to think about which video to do and I thought to do a thrift store haul even though these are these are things I got from like um a f like probably a month or two ago but since I haven't been posting or anything I'll just show it to you like I just got it yesterday. I got a lot more stuff but I want to show you my favorite things that I got and things that I still haven't used yet. I have this big pile of clothes that I am ready to show you. Um, I have some hanging too, so that's why I'm also looking over here. So let's just get started into the video. So the first thing that I want to show you is this is this top, and um, it's it's actually vintage. You can tell it's vintage because of the tag, and I really like this top. I've been wearing it um, quite a few times. It's like green stripes and it's it's really cute I wear this with a lot of things I wore it there's an outfit that I wore it with um, some baby pink undershirt um, there's an outfit where I wear it with uh, flannel and so I like do a lot with this top and I love it so yeah got it for like 69 cents I think this next top I got is for like you know obviously some good nice out nice day outs or something like that it's for the it's for the good you know what I mean I wish I knew before I bought it that it had a uh, what is it called a baby pin no a bobby pin no safety pin it has a safety pin connecting the straps so I haven't really worn it because because of that reason but I may wear it just for like pictures and everything and it's like it's just regular in the back so I got it because it was really cute and when I picked it out my friend was like get it and I was like oh okay the next thing I got this was actually pretty recent it's a little dinged up but I still really like it it's this yellow purse and I thought I could do a lot with this so that's why I got it on the front it says Lawrence.c Paris and it seems like it's a well-known brand but I've never heard of this brand and it's like um it has pockets and everything and this front part I just thought it would be really cute for like pictures and like outfits because and also because I never had a yellow purse like my purses are hanging on my doors and they're all brown and one is white. I don't have a yellow purse. So I got this and I and I can't wait till I use it. I haven't used it yet, so I'm excited. And the next thing I have is this Pacific Trail quality outerwear um windbreaker. I love this jacket. I love this jacket like I can't express here let me show you and it looks like this I'm also looking at the mirror behind the camera so like if you see me like looking off to the side that's why it has like Pacific Trail on the side it's super cute it has pockets in the inside and everything like I love this bag this jacket and it's vintage so of course your girl bought it and it has a hoodie in the inside like can this jacket be any more perfect there's so many vintage jackets at um at the resale shop or the thrift store um and i'm just and i want to pick out every single one of them but it's also not winter anymore the next one i have 
is this polo sweater and this is my favorite sweater well I have another favorite sweater so disregard that one but this is one of my favorite sweaters and it has um it has polo jeans on the bottom and I've always wanted a sweater with a stripe across because it's like so in the trend and it's really loose and I like it it's it's honestly my favorite sweater and what did I tell you you can always get the name brands from the thrifts and I don't mind buying name brand from the thrifts because they're usually vintage and I like it the next top I got was this um, Ralph Lauren top and it's off the shoulder I've actually wore I actually wore it in one of my recent posts on my Instagram and I wore it with my Adida pants and in my Fenty slides which are over there it's really fitted on so I wear it with looser bottoms on so the next thing the next thing was so perfect until I ruined it. You can slap me later. I got these Tommy Hilfiger jeans and they're vintage as frick. And um, I got them and originally they were um, flare. So I, um, I cut them, stitched them up and made them cuffed. And, um, but then I was like, I kind of really want like a rip in them or something, you know, like something to kind of make them mine. And I cut too big of a hole. I'm really sad about it. Like, I know you can yell at me. You can, you can, you can do whatever you want because I would do it too. I'm so mad about it. Like now I only wear them in pictures because I can't wear them out anymore. And they were vintage, they're Tommies. And I just stuck, I said, you know what? F you Tommy Hilfiger and did a whole big haul on them. And I'm very ashamed of it. I'm very sad. And now I can't really wear them. So thanks a lot, me. Thanks a lot. Last thing I got was pretty is actually pretty recent. And um it's this cotton and borrow sweater. I kind of ripped it a little bit on accident because the stitching is actually pretty bad that's probably why they took it in but um because the stitching rips pretty easily but it has like this kind of um plaid formation in it i don't know what you would call that but i really liked the color of this i've always wanted like this type of sweater so i was like girl let's get it of course like i told you in my last thrift store video um when you go to the thrift store you always get a mug and so I wanted to show you these two recent mugs that I have gotten and um, I don't know if I had showed you this one but I'm gonna show it to you anyway and it's this Cafe Godiva mug it is so pretty look at it get jealous get jealous it's so pretty I freaking love this mug and um i got this one too and it has like little people on it i thought it was really cute it has like a little house as well i hope it's focusing because i can't see <laughs> and um it's super cute and it's like vintage it was made in Ty taiwan and i thought it was super cute so i got this one too yeah that was my thrift store haul i hope you like some of the stuff that i got and like i told you you can always get name brand from thrift because the vintage name brands are surfacing. If you want to hop onto that trend, go to the thrift store and you pay much less than actually looking on like a shop online or a vintage shop online. Just go to just go to the Goodwill, go to your local thrift store and start shopping because you get a you get a lot of cute stuff for cheap. TBH. I need to think of another video to do because I have no idea. I have no idea. Like I said, it took me forever to even think about doing this video, so I had to think of other videos to do. But um, yeah. So I guess that's it. It's kind of an awkward ending, but um, see you guys later. I don't know. See you on the flip side. That's all I got to say. See you on the flip side.